I calculated back since like mid-March or so. That's about when the quarantine happened. And since mid-March, so like like two months ago, I have spent think you my dude, think I know you either way. Yeah, I know you want me still guys and welcome back to a new video of mine today i'm going to be sharing with you guys what i bought during quarantine and whoo you guys i spent way too much i spent more than i should have but you guys i blame it on the quarantine okay i've spent 899 dollars and 62 cents so i'm just gonna go ahead and jump right into this little amazon haul because I have so much things I want to talk about. I won't go into super big detail about them because I have a lot of things to share. So I probably will um, just like tell you what it is and how much it was. And maybe if like I really liked it, I would recommend it or something like that. But you guys, there's so much stuff <laughs> that I wanted to mention was this pure cast out soap. And I've heard so many good things about it. Like people saying it's good for eczema and stuff like that. This bad boy was $28.72, and let me tell you it wasn't even worth a penny because it dried out my skin and I think I had allergic reaction to it and I don't even use it. So there's still tons of this left and I don't even have use for it, so I'll probably give that away. This one, I actually really like this one and I use it quite often. This is the Burt's Bees Mama Bee Nourishing Body Oil. So it's technically meant for people who are pregnant and they can rub this over their belly, you know, just to help make sure everything is nice and moisturized and stuff like that. I really like this a lot and I actually incorporate this with the lotion that I use right now and just rub it all over. I actually even put this on my face. It even has like a slight like lemony scent to it and it smells so good and I actually like really like like this stuff a lot. If you guys really wanted to, you could actually add this to your bathtub and use it kind of like a bath oil. So that stuff, I use that a lot. Next item I bought is actually also for pregnant women as well. It's a massage lotion. It's literally meant for stretch marks and it's by Palmer. It's a cocoa formula. This was $5.17. I mentioned it, that oil um, from Burt's Bees, that was $5.29 like this stuff but I feel like it doesn't really do anything it's really moisturizing and it feels like it's going to you know penetrate into your skin and really help with moisture but as far as stretch marks if you already have pre-existing stretch marks it doesn't really help get rid of them but I feel like it might be able to help prevent them if someone were to get pregnant and you let rub this over your belly I thought to help this with pre-existing ones which it doesn't so that kind of was a no-go. This is in no specific order or anything. I'm just literally going through like the stuff that I have in front of me here. So this is a blow dryer. I picked this up because, uh, so the blow dryer that I did have, I was blow drying my hair and then all of a sudden I heard like this big poof and I thought my hair was on fire. I started to see smoke and I was like freaking out. I was like, oh my god. And um, so yeah, I thought my hair was on fire, but my blue dryer, blue dryer, my blow dryer gave out on me and took a crap. So it literally like poofed and stopped working and started smoking and I was like, okay. So I had to pick up a new blow dryer. This one was $49.85. I think some of this stuff has changed in price as well since I've ordered on Amazon. I feel like prices fluctuate and get a little higher or get a little lower depending on the buyer and where it's coming from, I guess. <clears throat> but this is the Trezoro iconic systems and I really like it. It's black and it's like a rose gold reddish color and it works really good. It's really powerful. It's not too loud. It's just literally a good blue dryer. This is a resistance band. I literally use this all the time for like all of my workouts and it's just really really good to incorporate in for strength training. I really like this one because this is a longer band. I have a lot of the shorter ones which can do like squats and stuff like that but this one allows you to do a lot more different exercises and it's really affordable it's only like $16.99 so definitely a good find my compression socks these I picked up for work and let me tell you I have bought compression socks on Amazon before but these are my absolute favorite because they don't roll or don't move so like I could work like a whole 12 hour shift and these suckers will not move I don't have to adjust them I don't have to keep pulling them up they literally stay in place and they don't move and I absolutely love them. And they do come in different colors as well. 
and these were a little bit expensive for one pair of $17.95, but worth it. I can't find these couple items. I don't know where I put them, but I will leave a little picture here. I did end up purchasing some belly rings, and they were really cute. They were only $10.99. And then I also picked up what was called silicone rings, and I use these for work when I'm a clinical assistant, so that way I don't get my ring dirty or, like, um, I really like using the silicone rings for, like, days I feel like I'm going to get really, like, hot and sweaty or dirty or feel like I'm just working hard. I don't want to, like, cling my ring on something. So those are $11.99, and they do come in some different colors. So one thing that I did pick up was a microphone for my YouTube videos. It is connected to my camera right now. I thought my sound was off this whole time. I was going to cry. So far, I really like it, but I feel like it's not my favorite thing in the world. If I could pick this over something else, I probably would have researched and got something better. For the price, I mean, the microphone was $32, which isn't terrible compared to some of like the Rode microphones that are like hundreds of dollars. But I feel like I'd rather pay the money for something else because I feel like the audio on this doesn't really get very well. I feel like it's better when I'm facing the microphone, but if I'm like behind the microphone, it sounds so weird and just like, I don't know. It's just not really good. So this thing here I've talked about previously during my supplement routine, and it's just a little pill organizer. I absolutely love this thing. It's cheap. It's only $7.98, and it's really big. It does hold lots of vitamins. It's thick, and I love the colors, and it's so easy to work with. You can literally just press a button and they just open so easily and I really like them. also talked about these during my supplement routine so I'm not going to go in depth with them. So um, these here are just some fiber gummies. They are what they say. They help you with bowel movements. Um, this next one here is a blood builder so it's a multivitamin but it also has a built in iron. And the gummies I believe were... $20.08, which I think is a good deal because it lasts you a long time and it's something that I needed in my diet according to my doctor. So the multivitamin was $22.87, which are normal for supplements, so really like those lately. Another supplement that I've been taking currently is for um, hormonal imbalance. My menstrual cycles have been kind of irregular lately. So I bought these to make sure like it can help my reproductive system and um, it also does say it helps with uh, fertility which I'm not using it for that. I'm just helping it with my periods currently. Um, so this is what they look like and these were $20. This little guy I've talked about in my Amazon favorites video. This is only $11.99 but I really like it because you could be like laying in bed or something or using this in the kitchen and it just holds your phone for you. You can even lay it like this, which I really like. <clears throat> so that comes in handy if you don't have like a pop socket or anything. And then you can also use your charger while you're, um, you're using the stand. So there's like a little hole here where your charger can feed through. And it's really cute and I feel like it's pretty affordable and it's not too bad. So I won't leave a um, super detailed description of what I picked up for my nursing school supplies. I have already made a video about this so I will leave a card up here and then I will also leave a link down in the description if you guys want to see that video. But um, I just wanted to point out my favorite backpack from um, my nursing school stuff. So this backpack is awesome. It's seriously so good. I love it so much. It is $39.99, which is really affordable. It's just so spacious. You can charge your phone on this thing and it just holds a lot. I'll go, um, I'll show a couple things that I have in my backpack, but I'm not going to go into really big detail at all. So I've talked about my little pocket drug, buy, drug guide book. Um, and then I have this little organizer in here currently. And then it looks like this. You can literally use it for whatever you want, but I just have a lot of organizational things in here. So little sticky notes, pens. Um, I do have like my little foldable clipboard in here. So it looks like this. And it just opens up like that. And it's just gonna be really handy to carry stuff around. It has my planner in here. So it's literally just like your everyday stuff that can go in here. About my stethoscope, um, which was really, really cute, but it's also 
I think it was like $89.99 at the time when I bought it. It did drop in price. It went down to like $76.25 now, which I was like, okay. But super cute. I love this stethoscope case that I purchased. It looks like that. And I've showed everything in my nursing school supplies video as well, like I said. But stethoscope here, and then I did buy like a little stethoscope charm, sort of like a little diamond thing. And that was pretty affordable. It was only like $8.34. But every single nursing school supply that I purchased added up to about roughly $214.60. And that was all from Amazon. I've even bought stuff in stores, so that's not even like how much I spent in general. So this is literally just everything that I purchased just from Amazon. And yeah. I believe these leggings that I purchased are in the washer currently, so I can't show them on camera, but I'm going to tell you that these leggings are so amazing. They're from the brand Core 10, which I've mentioned on my channel a ton. If you guys are new here, I love Core 10. It is um, definitely a, a little pricier, but still affordable, and they come in plus sizes, so that's one big plus. They don't ride... Um, up they don't like slip down you barely have to adjust them ever during throughout the day and I just love their leggings so much I will leave a picture up here this specific legging though has like little hold detail patterns in the legs and I thought they were so cute the material of these leggings are way different compared to the other leggings that I purchased in the past um, they're more of like a active wear material compared to like a lugging material so I really like these they were $33.80 and I will like I said I'll leave a picture up here if you guys can see that but those were really good fine thing that I purchased was a medicine ball I think that's what it's called it is $38.97 and I use this again a picture will be listed here I really don't feel like going down to my basement to go find this ball <laughs> and I use this to work out with so I will do a ball uh, on your back and you put it against the wall and you can do squats with it <clears throat> you can do crunches on it you can um, do chest workouts while like laying backwards on the ball stuff like that and that's been really handy lately the thing that I really liked too is my camera tripod which is being used right now so I'll also leave a picture it was $25.88 totally totally worth the money I freaking love this tripod it has allowed me to get so many different angles for my videos and do things that I've never really been able to do before because it has a button on the front that you can adjust your camera to like tilt forward and backward or side to side and I just absolutely love it it's seriously one of the best finds that I've ever had was one thing that I purchased that I can't tell you guys about because it's part of my giveaway when I hit 5,000 subscribers. So I can tell you it was $16.39, so it's not very expensive, but seriously, it's such a good find, and I, I'm so sure that you guys will love it, so um, I can't tell you what that is. Uh, one thing that I purchased were these baskets for our spare bedroom for the closet. They were $24.99. They are not here yet. Um, I literally just ordered them a few days ago. And that, um, like I said, is still on the way, so I haven't got them yet, but I will list them here so you guys can see what they look like. $24.99, super cute. The thing that I purchased also was a nail kit, and this nail kit was, I think it was $60, yeah, it was $60.99. Um, it came with, you know, gel polish, it came with a, um, a light for your nails as well, you know, base, uh, base coat, top coat, stuff like that. I actually purchased this but then ended up getting refunded for it from a company for a video, a collaboration. So I did end up buying it but then I ended up getting it refunded so technically I really didn't buy it but I did, if that makes sense. <laughs> and I absolutely love this kit. I have a video of me doing my nails as well with that kit on here on my channel so if you guys want to check that out you guys can. One other thing that I purchased was Smart Sweets. They are a company where they make a bunch of candy and they are actually only three grams of sugar and the only place I was able to find it was GNC but I actually found out that they sell them on Amazon too. I buy them from and I bought a pack of six and it doesn't say the price anymore on Amazon. I tried to look but I believe they were $16.99. I remember it being pretty expensive um, for just a six pack and I mean it's pricey but they were so good and they're only three grams of sugar. <laughs> 
so another thing that I purchased was for my work and it is a scrub jacket and the material on this you guys is amazing again I think this is in the washer too because I'm continuously washing my clothes because um, of working in the hospital I'm trying to like make sure I keep up on laundry make sure things are being washed and not sitting out and stuff like that so this is in the washer as well, but this was such a good find. It was $35.98, and I've got so many questions on where I got this jacket from. It is just really good quality, and it's so, so stinking cute. Purchase, actually I repurchased this because I've actually bought this before, but I ran out of it, and I had to replace that. And I emptied the container, so I had to buy a new one, which is the Palmer's Cocoa Butter, and it's specifically meant for dry cracked skin and it even says on the back that it helps um, problematic skin such as eczema so that is one of the reasons that I purchased it I'm telling you guys this stuff makes my skin feel so moisturized and it just feels really good on my dry hands it's actually really affordable for a big tub that lasts quite a long time it's actually six dollars and eighty five cents so I absolutely love that stuff and like I said you can get it from Amazon this is all strictly Amazon stuff and you can purchase it in stores as well. I think they have it at Target, but uh, such a good deal and it's really affordable. Well, I also picked these up for work a long time ago. This was not a recent Amazon purchase, but these were, and these are really affordable. I think they were only like $10 or less, um, but these are awesome. These work so good and I love the colors. I love this rust gold one. This one's my favorite, but they work so good and they come in real good handy. Before you guys freak out, yes, you're seeing some baby stuff. No, I'm not pregnant. Uh, we decided that we wanted to have it where we were more than prepared before nursing school, like if anything were to happen. These are literally the only baby items that I bought. Just these little onesies and a little elephant, that is all. The rest is just structural items for the room. So I bought curtains. I bought these little triangle shelves, and I did get those um, baskets and the organizer and everything. I did end up doing a little accent wall in my last video, so I got that done. So I just painted the room and just getting the room ready itself. But the things I got from Amazon were these curtains. These were pom-pom curtains. They're so stinking cute, and they were such a good deal. I think they were $35 for the both of them which isn't terrible. I love them. They're such good quality and I just feel like they are so cute in here. So those were from Amazon. I did purchase this from Amazon. It's called a accordion rack which was like $20 I believe. And then these triangle shelves. Um, I will list it on the screen but I think it was like between $30 and $40 for these which is a really good deal. These are such good quality and they're huge. They're way bigger than I thought than online. This um, just got sent to me. I did not buy this. This is a juicer and I'm going to do a video on that. So make sure you guys are paying attention to my videos and being subscribed and have the notifications on because I'm going to be doing a review video of this juicer and I'm so excited. I forgot that this elephant was actually from Amazon too. I purchased that. That was $16.99. Which isn't terrible, I mean it's kind of expensive, but I saw that and I wanted it so bad. So this is the last item that I have to talk about. These are the containers I've bought in. These are not all of them, I still have more in my dishwasher. But these are such a good find, they come in such a good variety of sizes. They come in like circle ones, rectangle ones. I love the lids, I love how aesthetic they are. They're white, I've had a hard time finding ones that are white and just clean looking. Um, they're dishwasher safe and the lids go on really well. I haven't tested it for like liquids or anything, but they just work so good. And for the variety of sizes you get, the price is really good. I think they were $48.99. I'll have to double check. Guys, so that is everything for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. This was such a fun video to show you guys everything that I purchased during quarantine. I spent almost 900 no. It was literally like $900, $899.62. in $99.62 in two months is insane. I don't know what happened, but I blame it on the quarantine, and I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I purchased, and without further ado, I will see you guys in some future videos. I will see you guys next time. Bye! Think you my dude, think I know you either way. Yeah, I 
I know you want me still.